What's up, beautiful people? Welcome back to Toya CTV. I'm back, episode eight, season four of Black Sales. We coming down to the wire, folks. We coming down to the wire. So, last episode, it was a lot going on. So, Roger Wood Sausage found out that Eleanor was pregnant because, you know, when they was preparing the body for burial, the, I guess, doctor found that, found out that she was pregnant. Then, um, before that, before he came in the room, the doctor, he was blaming her, um, assistant. I don't remember her name, but he was blaming her for putting ideas in Eleanor's head, Eleanor's head about shooting at him and stuff like that. But she was like, no, 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 no. I did not do that. Eleanor's gonna do what Eleanor's want to do, and she was doing it all for you. So that was that. Then, Billy. Billy came to talk to Roger Wood Sausage, and he's kind of teaming up with him on getting Flint killed, or really Silver and Flint and everybody else. He said he don't care no more. Like his hate. Is so strong for Flint that he rather go to Roger Wood Sausage and team up with him to get Flint killed and Silver and everybody. But he was like, I know how to do it. And how did he know how to do it? My girl Maddie is alive. <laughs> I was so happy when I saw that she was alive because I just knew she was burnt up in that house. And the only way they could get Maddie back if they give her, give the cash. And did they say Flint too? But I know definitely the cash. But Flint was like, no, we're keeping the cash because we need that for, you know, for this war. We just going to go sneak in and get her and keep the cash and come back. But little does he know. Uh, so one of y'all in the comments told me that Silver put the cash on the boat. I was thinking her mother got Julius to put the cash on the boat. So, I don't know. Then, uh, so that's gonna be crazy. Then we got Jack. Jack went to Eleanor's grandfather to ask him for help. He said no, because of course he was in front of all his, um, not coworkers, but colleagues. Um, in front of his colleagues and they know that how his family like Eleanor and her dad and all of that did so he said no but his wife grandma was like let me talk to you so she talked to Jack she was like my husbands don't make no decisions without me I'm really running the show I was like okay lady so she's really running the show um, and so she wanted to talk more to Jack. And so Jack bought, uh, Max with him. Max had the book of, I guess, all their logs and, and profits and stuff like that. But the, I guess her accountant that was looking at the book was like, well, how are you doing all of this? I don't see no slaves up in here. Like, how are you doing all this? And... She was like, I ain't really have no slaves. But grandma figured out, mm, why was that? Because we all know Max was a slave, sex worker, all of that. So she vowed never to have slaves or people that did not, I guess, did not want to. She didn't want nobody. She didn't want to force anybody to work for her. So therefore, she didn't have slaves or anything like that. So... Now we come to episode eight, and I can't wait to see what's going to happen. I ain't going to even read the synopsis because that be giving stuff away. But anywho, so if this is your first time here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell so you know when I drop a video. And enough talking, let's get right into it. Okay, who is this on this horse? It's like a soldier. Oh, uh, Roger Wood Sausage. 
What are you doing? What is he looking for? Probably something Billy told him to get. I knew it. No! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Secure the cash ends badly for me. You can be certain it will end badly for you. The plan will work. What is it? You want the exchange of the money taken off this island. Somewhere no one need know of it. There it is. Ooh, Billy got beat up. And they will follow you. What is that? Uh-oh. What if the result of this war isn't beyond the horror? We'll have the right people in place to lead us through it. And hold the world together while we find the spell. Cash is critical to our war, but so is she. Critical to holding our lines together. Ooh, oh, she got stitches. <gasps> she got stitches. She let Max take care of her? Oh, Max, you better, Max, you better be careful. Why are you doing this? Talking about us like it's a thing. They are losing faith in you. I know you intend to ransom away that slave woman to Captain Flint and his maroon allies in exchange for the pirate's cash of gems. My wife. begin again on this island and they know that it was because you invited it and you are going to have a mutiny on your hands sir. oh glad she's been waiting for us it looks like she knew where to wait for us jesus christ on that rail freaking billy he knew where they was gonna be he knew where they was gonna go and there's Marty. So they plan is no more. There go your plan, Flint. Right the four topsails brings about. Gun crews in the ready. Gun crews. Uh oh. Woo! He don't know about the cash. The cash, buddy. No, 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 no. Hurry up, Silver, Silver, Silver. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Wave a flag or something. Wave a flag, please. Wave a flag, wave a flag, wave a flag. No, 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 no. Oh, God. Oh. Flint trying to think of something. He was about to kill her. Kill her for real. She was going to die for real. What? Governor moves in a dark and destructive direction. His grief and his anger. I believe that I'm naughty for his foul judgment. I may be able to help you get back inside. Back on the council. I found a journal that you kept. 
I knew it. In it, she mentioned that when Nassau last threatened to descend into chaos, you were the one to whom she turned to help prevent it. Uh oh. But why is he helping her? When you asked me if I could help you learn where the governor's ship went, to what place he drew Captain Flint. Who was this? Jack! When did they get back on NASA? I don't understand. If the governor knows our destination, why can't he just plot a course directly to a spot in the chart? Because Skeleton Island is not on any chart. Not. Uh oh. I let you try your way. I did trust you. But I'm through wagering with her life. In what it takes to secure her release is to turn over the cash. I'm very glad I brought it with us. Now you've given him all he needs to kill this war dead. My God. The number of times I have followed you blindly. Backed you with the men blindly, put men in the fucking ground. Stood it, I may not have supported it, but I did it. And God damn it, right now you're going to return the favor. Right. But do not ask me to choose. Ooh. I do not think you're going to like the answer. Oh. His wife, when did they get married? Ooh. Her hands. What are you doing, girl? Oh, you gonna try to cut the bread? Don't cut yourself. Oh, why you have the girl to do it? Yeah, get her to cut you a piece of bread. Or just you bite it. You leaving? You killed a friend of mine. Uh-oh. Her name was Charlotte. <gasps> that girl. Oh, I remember that. There were men I knew that would have killed you for me. Girl. But Max refused. And they ate when she said you Girl, don't come in here with no mess. Because despite the world reminding her every day of her life that she's undeserving of being given anything by it, she never believed a word of it. You killed my friend. I wanted you to know that. Okay. I thought she was about to come in here, grab that knife off the floor. I understood there was someone you wanted me to meet there today. Has something changed? Uh oh. What's going on? So let us assume that we're past conversations about ledgers and that the measuring of you and your proposal are done and that we are past. In a venture. Acquire and reform NASA. Oh. Okay. So who gonna lead it? Edward Houghton. The only male heir to his family's banking operation. Supremely uncurious. If he's not the man you would like to put in charge of NASA. I'd like to put you in charge of NASA. On this particular issue, the world won't. <laughs> family would be relieved beyond measure that he'd found himself a future far away from their business. Yeah. He'd come with money, with open doors and new partners. You think you would listen to me as an advisor? Not an advisor. You think you would listen to me as a wife? Yep, I knew it! She's trying to teach her how to be her. Oh! Max, Oh, Max. I am stepping to Skeleton Island. 
He, oh my gosh. Right. My Lord, Jack. Very old man over there can get us there. Jack gonna get killed. I just know it. Why are we still standing here? If you leave him alive long enough, he's going to make you pay for it. Oh. Oh, his face like, uh, uh what? Excuse you? Teach don't look like he's going to listen. <laughs> Not teach, I call them teach. Hands. She has committed to the plan. To me. The moment we have been working towards since we arrived. Say yes? No, but wait till she tell you the stipulations. I told her I could not agree to it. Oh. You told her no. The man of her choosing and she wants me to be his wife. His wife? He said no to marry and that he is plan. Despite having no alternative and at the risk of losing the empire. I endeavor because I refuse to a man in a position where he might interfere one day oh. with my ability to repair things with you. Oh. Captain's log identifies her having set sail from Havana in 1636. 1636? Oh my gosh. Huh? They ate each other alive. Oh my gosh. It said that the crew had refused to go inland to forage for food or for fresh water. So they ate each other. <gasps> they go to wreckage. The first men in had returned, reporting sounds coming from the forest. <laughs> what is about to happen? It's an open question how much of the story Adrian invented. And how much is true? Oh my gosh, Flint. Who was that they killed? Who was that, Silver? Or oh, him, hands. Silver is seeing them. He said he w he had to see it for himself. Ooh, his face shaking. Captain Flynn killed one of my men. We managed to haul the cash to shore. I sent six of my men after him. The best men I have left. Their orders. In no uncertain terms, as a trap for Captain Flynn, and retrieve the cash. What else did you tell them to do? I instructed them to kill the Captain Woo! I knew it! <laughs> this is about to be crazy! It's about to go off. I knew it. Yeah. All right, folks, so that was episode eight, and it has gotten crazier. Okay, so I didn't understand how Jack got back to Nassau so quickly. Like, I thought he was still in, where were they, Philadelphia, with Eleanor's granddad. 
But him and Hornigold, was that Hornigold? Feather, no. Featherstone? Y'all know who I'm talking about. But <laughs> they are in the whorehouse, I guess, hiding. And the madam has told them what Eleanor's assistant told her that she got from the diary. It's like all these pieces, everybody got an agenda. I mean, everybody had an agenda anyway, but everybody really got an agenda now. Now, Jack supposed to be going to Skeleton Island where Flint them at to try to still kill Flint. But I just know Jack probably going to die. Then, Billy just, the plan just, you have to go with plan B. with Because Billy told Roger Wood Sausage everything. So, good thing Silver, Long John Silver brought the cash. Because he killed the three men that they sent on the island. Because Billy kn knows the route, route, route. Knows the route of every which way the pirates will sneak in. And he killed the three men and he was about to kill Maddie. If Long John Silver did not have that cash, Maddie would have really been dead, okay? But then here come Flint. Flint was like, I need a new partner. So he got the, whatever that guy name is, to take the cash and swim to the island and I don't know what he was going, like, what they going to do. But yes, now that Flint, I mean not Flint, Long John Silver see it for himself. Because Hands could have, like, fought them or shot them or something. But he told him to go. Because he was like, Long John Silver not going to believe nothing I say until he see it for himself. And he saw it for himself. He told he 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 sent six men. Now these was them some good men he sent. The the uh the man with the black hair, hands, and some more that really good fighters. But you we know how Flint Flint can fight. So I don't know how this gonna go. So he told him to retrieve the cash, but if they can't, kill Flint. Because Silver like Silver like, because at this point, you first are, are testing my gangster. Then, you put my wife in jeopardy. And when did him and Marty get married? Or oh, he just calling her his wife. But anywho, Silver's like, okay, I told you don't do nothing. Because Maddie's life is in their hands. But you go behind my back and do this? Oh, no. We're not friends anymore. Everything's off the table. And I don't blame him. Because we know Flint is going to do everything possible for Flint plan to work. When he has a plan, he don't want to hear what nobody else say. He going to do what Flint plan is. Okay? But I can't wait to see the last two episodes because I know it's about to be crazy, crazy. So, it was that everything? Yes. So if you made it to the end of this video, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell so you know when I drop a video. Comment like I do also oh well on these black cells, giving me all the ins and outs. And follow me on Instagram and TikTok at Hairstyles with the Z15. All right, folks, I will see you on the next one. It's about to be crazy!